guys, I am Brana Joy P. Balaja and today I am going to introduce to you one folk dance which is the Lanceros de Tayabas. And I am also going to teach you and show you the dance terms and the fundamental dance steps and positions being used in this dance. Are you ready? Let's get started. To start off, let us shortly discuss the origin or the brief history of this dance. Lanceros takes its name from the jewelers, knights, and dancers of King Arthur's fame. Taking off from tournament rounds, the Lancers was reinterpreted into a formal dance form performed in great ballrooms of majestic places or palaces where noble gentlemen cross lines with graceful ladies. In Tayabas, the dance came to be known as Lanceros de Tayabas. Noted as the advertisement for the Comedia stage play, also a Spanish import. For the costume, for the female, it's Barok Saya, and for the male, it's Barong Tagalog. Here are the samples, pictures, or the pictures of the costumes. For its properties, the scarf or baksa is a soft banana with floral design. And for the skirt or saya, it is a overskirt or sobrefalia, a plain checkered of strip wrapped around the waist and gathered on the left side, reaching below the knee. While for the music, it's two-fourth, composed of seven parts, A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. And for its count, it's one, two, or one and two, or one and two and two a measure. Now, let us proceed to the fundamental dance steps, terms, and positions being used in this dance. First is the clockwise. It is like the motion of the clock. Right shoulder is toward the center of an imaginary circle. When facing center, the movement is toward left. And second dance term being used, counterclockwise, reverse direction of clockwise. Third is the high on high on to place one forearm in front and the other at the back of the waist. And for the fourth, saludo. Partners bow to each other, to the audience opposite dancers, or to the neighbors with feet together. This is a Spanish origin and is used in almost all Philippine dances. Fifth point, touch the floor lightly with the toes of one foot, weight of the body on the other foot, and for the sixth dance term, inside foot. The foot near one's partner when they stand side by side. And seventh, free foot. The foot not supporting the weight of the body. Number eight, outside, ha outside hand. The hand away from one's partner when they stand by side. Number nine is the dosido or the vis-a-vis -vis opposites. Both advance forward. Pass each other's right or left side. Step across the right or left. Move backward with turning around past each other's left or right side to proper places. This is of foreign origin and is used in many Philippine dances. Now for the fundamental dance positions, we only have two. Arms in second position and arms in fifth position. Lastly, for the fundamental dance steps being used, first is the cross step. Second is the heel and toe change step. 